Alright, and hey there Proxians, and this is Prox right here, and guys, and welcome back to another episode of the Super Paper Mario Let's Play. So if you guys missed out in the last episode, and I know that it has been quite a long time uh, from this uh, uh, from this uh, point on uh, throughout our episodes, throughout the Super Paper Mario series, uh, but if you guys did remember, we actually did do a live stream for this series back in the day, where we were actually uh, just going to do this whole entire series all live stream to just get this all, ga uh, basically get this game game all done and finished with but unfortunately we ran into a little bit of a problem with my dolphin unfortunately with the game that i had and from what i've heard from other different people uh, that have played uh super paper mario on the dolphin is that unfortunately uh during at some point uh when you head into 6-2 unfortunately what is going to happen is is that uh it, it it could probably happen to anyone uh but when you go into 6-2 unfortunately you're going to go and talk to that samurai guy and he basically crashes your whole entire game and that is exactly what happened to me so right now what we're going to be doing is actually doing this whole entire series solo uh so i have actually did a little bit of some other things off recording which i don't think i've ever actually got to show you guys during the time of the live stream uh, but there is a shop that's in Flopside where you can actually go and buy out on super uh super shroom shakes and you can also buy out on a ghost room where you can actually go and snack on the different enemies and uh actually go and uh, basically take care of those guys without even having to worry about even trying to do uh your own uh, uh, stomping attacks or whatnot uh with uh with uh, mario there which i think that is really cool and i never actually got to go and try out the ghost room yet but it would be a very interesting item uh to actually go and use uh, throughout this series but also too uh what i also did do is buy out on a few of the hidden treasure maps that were actually around in Flopside. you actually need to go and talk to a guy by the name of flam and uh he is actually the opposite guy uh to the flim a guy that is actually in the in the sewer type of area uh but this time uh let me know in the comments down below if you guys want me to actually go and search for the different hidden treasures that are actually going to be located in all the other different chapters of Super Paper Mario for the post game and I will actually go and uh, probably do that at some point in the near future but for what we need to do is that we are going to be diving right back into chapter 6 once again uh, so again we actually do need to have Bowser out here just so that we can be able to go and just do a, a lot of fire breathing on all the different samurais that are going to be there now I think also too from what I've also heard is that we also have to use Barry as well so that we could be able to just go and kind of blockade ourselves uh, from the samurai guys even trying to hit us so that's also gonna be really helpful on that uh, I think what I did here is that if I went and checked my eyes we actually do have a few of these shroom shakes we do actually have a life shroom as well and an also shroom shake which I think we should be alright but I think I'm gonna buy out maybe one more shroom shake before we actually go and head out into the open road once more just so that I don't really have to go and worry about having to uh, be a little bit crazy uh, while we're inside chapter six now there is a guy that is in flop side at some point uh where where i think i've already showed you guys this before but all you have to do is just pay out like 300 uh coins and he will actually make a tunnel which that you can be able to actually go and head back uh to where uh flip side or flop side is going to be whatever of, of your choosing is going to be and uh, that would actually be somewhat really helpful for us but uh, unfortunately i do have to go and kind of spend out on one more shroom shake so we're not going to have our 2000 left or, or sorry our 200 uh, coins left oh no uh, i don't want to go and spend on it anymore i think having four plus that uh ultra shroom shake should be fine oh, i think we should be good now again i think we already do have uh yeah so we're already sitting at uh, 35 hp just like from before if i'm not mistaken uh during our time of the live stream of super paper mario so let's just go and head all the way up here back to the elevator we go i don't know how long i'm going to be making this episode for i don't want to make it too too long because again uh hope you guys go and check out with the other live stream that we're doing uh since we are on the topic about live streams we are doing kirby return to dreamland uh, and hopefully you guys go and check out that throughout the uh, uh, throughout this week uh i feel like I, I i'm in a good mood to do a recording for you guys so i'm excited to head back into uh, doing chapter 6-2 once again i'm not going to really bother about worrying about any of the text dialogue or anything of the sort like that we already read through it during our time of the live stream so why don't we uh, so so why do i have to go and read it again right so not even gonna even bother about it 6-1 here we go let's go and take care of these samurai guys now i know that there's like a total of like a hundred of these guys that we have to go and fight off with and i think we only made it like i think just maybe like a quarter of the way through and then that's when that crash happened during 6-2 but we should be fine again. I know that we got ourselves that battle uh, with uh, with Mimi. Now, I think that was in 6-2 anyway, so we don't really have to go and worry about that right now. But hey, look at that. 
yeah so there's the uh the void that is here so it seems like that is going to get even much bigger during our time throughout this uh well throughout our whole entire chapter and throughout our uh, next chapter as well too with chapter seven which i do want to go and actually uh, continue onwards throughout here so we only got ourselves this door and that's literally about it and that's where we're going to be going and talking on over to the king now i know that at some point uh mimi kind of like uh kind of disguise herself as like what the king is and kind of tricks us off uh, by by thinking that we can just literally go and find our pure heart right inside that chest but that's not gonna happen but hey we're still one of these samurai guys already so let's go and do it man so you stop now uh you wear clothes of a crazy and you must be you mean to challenge me okay yeah well whatever we got ourselves our fire breathing attack we could be able to just go and take care of this guy no problem right <laughs> yeah we got some street fire going on come here dude here take that now the best way to get uh, or best way to like kind of hit him is by just kind of like uh, getting him right into that, that little corner spot and if you can and then just wait for the right time and then just go literally right in for the attack and if he actually starts trying to hit you then that's when you can go and use the berry and then kind of just kind of like just push him off immediately now for the big blue guys I think they're a little bit different and they kind of hit a little bit harder so uh, we have to kind of worry about that but I think Barry's still gonna be all right for the challenge here so so yep now the king is here say so what a rousing spectacle it was so now we got ourselves to now go and fight the rest of the other saber guys out here and he actually does have the pure heart man i don't know why but this guy seems like he kind of looks like uh, someone that came off of like south park or something because he kind of looks like one of those like uh, canadians like from south park <laughs> but the legend goes on and so i shall continue on a very dramatic reading okay well whatever i don't need to hear about your dramatic reading i'm just ready to just go and start pummeling out some guys i'm bowser damn it i'm allowed to go and literally start attacking on some other people here so hail samur hunter strong uh, these are my base. Uh, these are my vassals. So should you beat them all, then you will prove that you are a true hero. Yes, I shall reward you with the pure heart. So it's best that the other 99 saber guys. Yeah. All right. So hacha, and off they go. Now I know that there's like one guy that's supposed to be like, like super crazy. But either way, he's still like kind of a like like another uh, easy boss to like kind of get done. Now I think there's like one other saber guy that kind of has like a mace or something, like at some point. But again, another uh, another another enemy that's not really all that too difficult because each different saber guy is gonna be like almost the exact same type of way that it's always gonna be. Just keep on making sure they kind of like just point them into like into like the little corner and then just start breathing fire on them as uh, as hard as you can. So round two, here we go. Let's fight her out. All right. Now when he starts coming around like that, I'm just gonna make sure that I'm gonna hit you. Come on, jump back up. And there we go. Already finished and done with here. Now this is actually gonna be the second time that I'm ever gonna be using my Wii throughout uh, doing uh, any type of Wii series. Now I am gonna be going and uh, doing, I think maybe Xenoblade Chronicles or maybe Wario Land Shake It at some point. Now that has been another series on the mind that I kinda wanna do for uh, for my Wii games because again, uh, I'm starting to get into like the Wii collection type of mode right now and I wanna collect it out on some Wii games and I think I also wanna do some Let's Plays of, of Wii games in the future. Uh, so that's why I wanna kinda do uh, Super Paper Mario as well so that we can kinda to get that game finished and done with hey there we go already simple and easy come on man you have to make these fights a little bit harder right so i have failed the ancient uh, pawn uh, the ancient pawn is traditions by strike blacks puff yeah well it well i guess you didn't really go and try out your midas there mr sammer guy but let's just go and keep on heading on throughout here now the good thing is is that also two guys from what you have, have been uh, not seeing right now is that i am not actually holding down on any other type of buzz to actually go and worry about the ir scanning at all so literally we don't have to really uh, literally worry about having tippy try to like try to basically make her appearance all the time by like uh showing off by the ir scanner all the time so that's pretty nice oh and there we go we got one of these guys now you have to be careful about them as well too because they like to kind of just jump around and cause a distraction now i think they will actually come back during the time when we start fighting off with the big huge blue samurai guys but let's just keep on going so yeah we already went to take care of the guy with the mace so very simple quick and easy type of stuff now we already do have uh, some of our um, our healing items as well. I'm not gonna really go and worry about that yet until like we start seeing like the blue guys. Now these guys also do have a spike on their heads, so we can't really go and worry about jumping on them right now. But just breathing fire will work and do the trick. So there you go. Now I think also too you can also go and use berry on those guys when they start like uh, bringing out their little psychic buddies. Now uh, I wish I could have went and, and did that, but that's all right. 
Now, I don't know as well too, I think there's also optional pixels that you can also go ahead and grab. And I don't really know exactly on what I need to do for those. I may probably have to do some research on them. But if you guys want me to go and collect on all the different pixels, let me know as well too throughout this video. So we are already 10 minutes in and we're already doing somewhere pretty well. Uh, we already got like literally uh, six of the different uh, Samurai guys already went and taken care of. So there we go. We already went and finished out already. So not too shabby. Now I think here in this first part of this chapter, I believe we have to go and take care of like uh, individual of like 20 or 25 of them if I remember correctly I can't really I, I know it's been a while since we've done uh, the live stream but I'm pretty sure it's like 20 or 25 so we are still having to make it all the way up to those double digits but again these guys are like gonna just be, basically just be rinse and repeat just keep on using the fire breathing attack and everything should be a-okay for the time being oh yeah there you go and then just wait for another time and then just go and breathe them on come on dude stop being annoying here take that Give me all that 500 damage right there so I can get some of my points up. And hopefully I can get myself a level up too. That would be really nice. Uh, now, also too, if you guys did remember during our time in the live stream, uh, I think before this chapter was even coming, uh, we did all like those Kragnon type of stuff and we were losing out on a, like a lot of different uh, EXP and stuff like that uh, for our next level up. Uh, I actually did not really have to go and worry about stomping on them because I already know on how that kind of works out because every time that you stop on those uh, Kragnons, you actually lose out on the, on the points that you want to have. So, I mean, sure, wow, jeez, uh, hey man. That wasn't very nice, and they actually explode too. Alright, well at least we went and take care of him. Brought his little psychic buddy out here again. No. No more sidekicks from you. Because that's what's going to like really hurt me in the process. I just want to just keep on moving forward, man. Don't even want to be even be in this problem at all. Now, I think the good thing is too, is that if you uh, actually go and take care of like one of the chapters, you can't actually go and return back to it if you actually do decide to exit uh, out of there. But you will have to actually go and like repeat right from the like the very beginning of the start of that chapter though. But you can't actually come back to them. So if I do need to go and pick up on like some extra like on, on like extra string shakes or something like that, I, I could actually be able to do that. But I would have to just kind of have to repeat through just that one part of the chapter, which that would suck. But anyways, let's just go and keep on moving forward and let's keep on going through the door. So what are we on to now? Are we on round 10 or round 11? I can't really remember. We're just going to just barely through these as fast as I can just so I can get everything done. Hey, we got ourselves one of the blue guys now. So let's just be a, a little bit careful. So he is Koopa in the winter. Uh, wait, and we'll by the 10th gate. Uh, excuse me. So that, play at, uh, that blues early freezes and perishes. So you should uh, too shall you. Okay, so this is round 10, so we're actually going to be starting off with these guys. Oh, ouch. Now, these I think we actually do need to kind of go and worry about uh, using Barry here for the time being. Now, uh, they will start to roll, and that would not be fun. But either way, he's already down and out. Nice. Uh, I don't like them when they jump on me. I had to kind of go and use Barry for that, but it was a little bit too late. Now, I am also using a Wii uh, controller, by the way, uh, so this is going to be a little bit different since I am not using a uh, an Xbox 360 or an Xbox One controller for that matter, so hopefully that can kind of make things a little bit, uh, maybe a little bit easier for me because I don't really have to go and worry about having to, like, change up the controls or anything. It's, like, already here right in front of my fingertips. Okay, there, cha-ching, let's go. Round 11. There we go. Hey, you get out of here, dude. I had enough of this. You have to start bringing out that little buddy of yours around here. Alright, so my wealth was in my battle skills and you have robbed me of them. My poverty of spirit is now matched for my empty pockets. Alright, get out of here, dude. Eh. Well, we're doing not too bad. We're just going right into Route 12 right now. So we are 14 minutes in. So this could be a really easy, quick and done chapter. And hopefully there's going to be a save point somewhere around in here. Okay, let's go for the next one. So you uh, challenge your skills to the duel of 100? Uh, well, I'm the guardian of the 12th gates. Okay. So yeah, each of these different places are going to be all gates here. But either way, he should be going down as quickly as possible. He's trying to deke me out, but you're still going to get hit by the fire, man. Either way. Come here. There we go. And he's already finished. Uh, I yield. Nice. Alright, another one is finished after all that. Let's keep on going. You don't want that void to get bigger. <laughs> now, they did say that there was a way to fix out the problems by using, like, Direct 12. 
like on Dolphin and that may probably solve out the issue but I've tried doing it and it just did not solve out the problem for me I wish I should be able to just bring my uh, my save file and just bring it over to my big computer but I don't know if uh, if that would still probably cause out the same issue because uh. but you know what it's fine just doing it solo this way and playing it on the physical copy just makes everything a lot better and a lot more simple in my mind um, hope you guys do enjoy uh, out with the resolution as well too uh, because again I do have an upscaler uh, for this to actually make my Wii go into 720p or 1080 uh, right now I am actually playing this on 720p right now uh, with 60 frames per second so hope you guys uh, do enjoy out on that uh, but I will be uh, changing out the resolution though on uh, uh, with my editing and, and all my other stuff like with Domra and all that thing so it'll make it actually upscale it up more up to like 1080p with 60 frames right after so hope you guys do go and enjoy out with all that I want to try and make everything as like the best experience for you guys uh, just so that we don't have to have to worry about any other type of problems or anything of the sort like that and again, I'm very happy that, that I never really got to know uh, anything before that my HD PVR could actually have like max settings, which I never thought that that would actually be a thing. So I always get to learn something new every day when I'm doing my editing. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Come here, you. Nice. So we already finished the double with that. So again, another saver guy has been destroyed. Alright, let's just keep on moving, man. You don't have to keep on talking to me. No, you guys don't have to keep on talking to me. I just want to just keep on going and just do my own Bowser thing, man. I'm here to have Barry just do some some barrier attacks to make sure that you guys don't have to hit me. But let's keep on going. All right, so you had defeated my brother. Uh, now I'm the second most famous student of the Sweaty Palm Martial Arts. Oh man! All oh, right, yeah. I think there's like three of these guys, right? So round 16. Here we go. Come on, get into the fire. Hey, I told you to get into the fire. There you go. <laughs> And another one has been defeated in the Sweaty Palm Academy. So let's keep on going. I think there should be one more left. All right, let's keep on going. Now, I know that uh, one thing was really cool was that uh, we actually got to see like a different form change of one of the Saber guys that was like a, a, red, a red and silver one. Um, but here we go, the Forbidden Slot former student. Oh man. Okay, so let's go and see what we got for this guy. He may be trying to slap me. Whoa, hey. Hey, 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 no, 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 no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Hey. Dude. Get out of here. Oh, man. I think I may probably have to use up one of my shroom shakes right now. Uh, I wasn't expecting for it to be like this. Oh, here we go. So, all the brothers are here. Okay. Let's just keep on moving, man. I don't need to read it. I just want to get myself healed. That's everything that I want to do right now. Okay. So, let's see. Yeah, we do kind of need to heal ourselves up right now. Now, also too, I do have like a stopwatch, a shooting star, and all that other stuff, which I did find, uh, kind of like fi uh, finding those like hidden around in some of the other different chapters, so I'm pretty happy that we do have those, just in case that we do need to go and worry about knocking out Mimi as like quickly as possible or something like that. But now we're about, oh no, we got ourselves a mini me guy out here. Now, I know that these guys were a little bit of a hard problem from before. Now, I don't know what he's going to do when he starts off. He may probably, oh right, yeah, he has like the... The way where he could just uh, go like really fast around here, but either way, just one little fire breathe and uh, or one more fire breath. Sorry, and uh, he should be able to just go down as quickly as possible. Okay, so we just went and taken care of the little mini guy. So I think there should be one more left or a few more left. Let's go and see. I want to make sure. So coming up this way here, got ourselves another one. So, uh, stoic and impenetrable, I'm the 19th gate. Oh, so we're getting close. So this is uh, round 19. Okay, here we go. Another not, another guy's gonna get himself knocked out. Come on, man, come here. Come to the fire breath. All right, oh, he still has another bit of HP left. Come here. Nice, and already went and taken care of him, and hopefully we can get ourselves a level up soon. And then I don't really have to go and really worry about having to use any of the super shrew shakes or any of the shrew shakes for that matter. Okay. Getting close. 27,000 uh, points that we actually do have right now. Ah, here we go. We got ourselves another big guy. So again, we already done this before, so these guys are really not all that too difficult. I think they're going to probably start doing a jump first on us. Oh. Hey. Come here, you. Come on. Are you going to start doing your ruling attack on me? Nope. Okay. Keep on doing this. Hey, get him done. Hey, hey. Already went taking care of the second one. Nice. So not too shabby at all. 
Oh, here we go. I think the dark void's getting a little bit bigger. Uh-oh. This is not good. I was not really expecting for that to happen so soon now. But with all of this stuff going on with Cal Black, it seems like he, his plans are coming very closely. Well, what else is going on here? Oh, yes, of course it is Cal Black. He already showed up, so it's already uh, far too late to stop Cal Black. Oh, man. So who the creepy cloud with the cave? Cal Black? Simple hair. Uh, so the prophecies are full, smoothly thanks to the chaos hearts, and the light of each world will be snuffed up one by one. So why would you want to do something so unspeakable? So you question Cal Black? This worthless world's destruction matters not, so for the matter of Cal Black, it will wipe out the existence, then let it remain. So how can you say that? That's so horrible. Uh, so Cal Black scoffs at you. In the insignificant pixel lectures Cal Black on what is right and wrong. So this is not up for discussion, your problem is sick. And all living things have a heart that they're priceless, and you just can't erase them? Oh, all things that you defend on the heart, nothing can be more worthless. And all things are meaningless. Aside from Tiffany, no treasure matter, uh, uh, mattered in the least to me. So, uh, Tim Timpany? Uh, speak no more. And this world is dying under the monocle gaze of Cal Black. But don't let that stop you from trying to find a pure heart that you'll never acquire. Uh, Black. And off he goes. So, oh dear. Uh, world goes squish soon. Must tell King Samurai must not uh, accidentally squish King again. Uh, and off he goes. Okay, so I guess that means would we be able to kind of do a little bit of a finish up here with our star, hopefully? Or maybe we can find a save point around here at some point. Alright, let's keep on heading through. I guess we got ourselves another one. Oh, it seems like you already stopped. So, now I think this is going to be the time where these guys are going to probably not uh, do any battles with us here. Since of what is going on. And with this void, it seems like these Sarah guys don't really want to go out and battle. So that's fine with me. Now we don't really have to go worry about talking about these guys because I've already done this before. So we're just going to keep on heading straight across. We got ourselves 22 minutes so I want to make sure that we have enough time that I can get this all finished and done with. Now there will be a save point I think at some point once we actually do uh, go and hit our next uh, chapter. So that will be nice and I can just go and just finish it off right here. At least we got ourselves a little bit of a, a little bit of an auto save to just kind of just go and finish off with everything. Don't really have to worry about trying to do a hard save. Alright, just keep on going. And got another one of those saver guys, but it doesn't really have to matter about that. Keep on heading through the last bit of these gates. Now, I think Mimi should be like the first uh, boss that we're going to be taking care of, like before we go and worry about all these other saver guys out here. Oh, that would have been a cool battle. That dude kind of looks a little bit like uh, Frieza from Dragon Ball Z a little bit there. Okay, there we go. But let's go in, open up this, and I think this will be our end of chapter. Okay, let me just see here. Is there going to be a save point and then I can just go and just end it off right now? So yeah, do you want to see our progress? Well, I'm going to be doing that right now. But thank you guys again for coming and checking out this video. We are going to be doing a fresh restart here in Chapter 6. Hope you guys are going to be enjoying the rest of the other series when we go and keep on continuing with Super Paper Mario. I do want to kind of revive this series back. So hope you guys are going to be, uh, hopefully, hopefully you guys did go and show up uh, during the live stream. You guys will be here, uh, hopefully, uh, for the solo series that I'm going to be doing. But I'll see you guys in the next one. And peace.